Good morning, guys. Good morning. <laughs> Are y'all liking the new hair, y'all? Yes, I am all natural, honey. This is all me, boo. But um, yeah, good morning. Y'all, you know what? I just noticed that I didn't show y'all my nails when I went to get them done in the last vlog. I don't know what happened to that footage, but anyways, these are the new nails. I like them. They're real chic. You know, a little French tip kind of. But yeah, y'all, it's breakfast time. Y'all already know the motherfucking drill. We about to have a thousand calorie breakfast. We're on breakfast number two. It's about to be a thousand calories. Let's okay, so today I'm having a breakfast burrito. First, you're going to need a tortilla. Three extra large or jumbo um, scrambled eggs with spinach. And I also used a serving of butter with these. All right, chicken. We need chicken. That's three ounces of grilled chicken. Boom. Okay. Next, I'm putting some bacon. That is one serving of bacon. All right, now we need some potatoes. Yes, these are potatoes, like hash browns, basically. And I cooked them with some onions and peppers. A serving of onions um, and red and green peppers. And cheese, because we need cheese, period. Cheese! We need cheese! Okay, and like we're almost done, but we need some sour cream. Let's top it with some sour cream. Okay, last and not least, we're going to put some salsa. All right, and that's it. That's it. Y'all, this is like my rendition of the chicken fajita um, burrito that they serve at IHOP. Yes, get into it, babe. All right, this is the finished product this is not going into a daggone burrito so it's whatever i'm gonna eat it anyways it's still going down period oh uh, yeah i'm about to eat that and then i'm also about to have some orange juice y'all already know gotta have me an eight ounce glass. already going down with breakfast and then after i eat breakfast we gonna go um to the like the crystal shop the holistic store or whatever because it's about to be a full moon on the 28th or the 29th i gotta figure out which date it's gonna be because your girl got some moon work to do you know i want to clean the house with a little sage or whatever but um yeah you know what i need to let y'all see what the body's looking like since i've been like eating these thousands of calories Okay, so this is what we're looking like right now, y'all. I don't know, like this is making me look like real skinny, but yeah, this is what we're doing right now. A look, this is the stomach. Suck it in though, okay. <laughs> and that's that on it. Oh, the healing one. Yeah, I, I don't know what those are mixed with. They stink. <laughs> but <laughs> the love stinks too. <laughs> what about protection? It smells like nothing. What about prosperity? All the good stuff stinks, so maybe it really works. It's like medicine. Yeah. <laughs> well, we do have probably healing and the prosperity in boxes. Oh, a full box. And you can kind of smell this box. Like here's the prosperity. Might smell different than that one. Oh, these are different brand then? Yeah, you smell virtue box. Mm -hmm. This is also Yeah, it's different. There might be some healing.
I wonder, is it worth living now? They told me dreams come true once you live it out. I picked up pieces from my childhood in a broken house. And heal my soul from the trauma we've been given now. I hear the whispers in the wind under smoky clouds. And tell myself once again, I'ma work it out. So much shit can happen, yo, it got me tripping now. Yeah, it's feeling different now. Feel like I'm zoned out, put my phone down, damn it's cold out. Plotting on a rollout, we took our own route, really on our own now. These them winter schemes, plotting for better dreams, cooking flows and melodies for OGs with felonies who've been locked since the 70s. You gotta pray for enemies with jealousy, they only feed off the good hearted. Just don't bargain, stay in your lane and keep hogging. Know that you a target and gotta finish what you started. Life of being an artist, gotta show them where your heart is. Put your all in, keep calling, keep going, don't stall it. Don't fall for what they all been wishing now. Just be yourself and it'll work it I out. wonder, is it worth living now? They told me dreams come true once you live it out. I picked up pieces from my childhood in a broken house. And heal my soul from the trauma we've been given now. I hear the whispers in the wind under smoky clouds And tell myself once again, I'ma work it out So much shit can happen, yo, it got me tripping now Yeah, it's feeling different now Yo, living in doubt could be the death for you It's only a few that are rep for you And rarely ones that are step to you And let you know where you wrong at Instead of letting you Ride away in your soul Rather be whole and pure in my spirit This life never ending until you near it A lot of shit to bear with Sometimes you don't wanna share it But don't keep it in cause you fear it It's an epidemic sound And you can see right where I'm headed I'm elevated, oh yeah We was waiting, oh yeah To make a statement, it's clear the way them boys persevere Yo, we taking the stairs Don't let them get in our air They go watch, I'ma stare Tell them pull up a chair God gon' answer our prayers Is it worth living now? They told me dreams come true once you live it out I picked up pieces from my childhood in a broken house And heal my soul from the trauma we have been given now I hear the whispers in the wind under smoky clouds And tell myself once again, I'ma work it out so much shit can happen, yo, it got me tripping now. Yeah, it's feeling different now. I wonder if it's worth living now. They told me working nine to five just to make it out. And now the dark nights got me needing mouth to mouth. Resuscitate my dreams, tell me what it's all about. I wonder if it's worth living now. Hey, y'all. It is the end of the week. It's been a long week, y'all. Y'all been with me all week. I've basically been filming all week, but right now it's Sunday. I'm about to, um, I didn't wash out that, um, perm rod set that I had in my hair. Y'all, that shit was so hard to do. Like, I was trying to film myself doing this perm rod set because I ain't did a perm rod set in, like, forever. And when I tell you that it was so, it was so tedious, time consuming. struggle but we did it we did it joe i'm going to the laundromat i mean um i need to do laundry but <laughs> what i was saying was i'm going to the salon and they're gonna have to do it but anyway uh i've been wearing a lot of makeup lately since i've been having the time i've been wearing makeup so i'm about to do a uh, um while my hair is deep conditioning i'm about to do this little face peel right here I'm about to do this um the ordinary aha and bha face peel because i noticed that my nose look at my nose oh look at me stop looking at me anyway i noticed that i have like blackheads in my nose so i'm about to put this on and i'm about to whiten my teeth y'all already know the deal i'm about to whiten my teeth right quick and yeah basically i'm just taking care of myself today um i've been taking care of myself all week like i went to the crystal store then i um went to i did pilates y'all um i think i like pilates more than um no i would say i like the yoga too i didn't turn this on how you turn this off i like the yoga hold on let me move this mirror so i can see what i'm doing but 
But yeah, I like the um I like the Pilates, but because it was more active, so I really enjoyed the Pilates. And then I also like the restorative yoga because on there, the um in the restorative yoga on that last vlog that was oh <gasps> what the this shit burning it burns <laughs> what it's burning <gasps> oh maybe that's too much oh uh, it's not burning as bad as that 15 percent tha but i mean like <laughs> it's tingling but um in the restorative yoga, like on that last vlog that was messed up, that I left posted, I sure did because <laughs> that's a part of my healing. Um, everything ain't perfect. Oh well. But um, yeah, um, I had went to restorative yoga, and then like in the restorative yoga, the lady that's in charge, she or the yoga, the instructor. She did a good job like you know like there was like this one time where we were resting or we were connecting with our feelings and she there was this like method that she used she was like what did she say she said if now is a time to release any trauma that's been held in your body knowingly or unknowingly and that really like moved me i was like yes like her saying that it was okay to release that trauma right then and there and the way that she said it like the unknowing trauma that you hold was um it really relaxed me and it stuck with me because i still re i remember that and i'm like sometimes i um ever since that class i kind of repeat that to myself like now is the time to release any knowing or unknowing stress that I'm holding right now. Whenever, um, you know, like in the middle of the work week when I'm motherfucking tired, I say that. Ooh, but it burns. <laughs> and then the Pilates, I like the Pilates, y'all. I had a whole glass of wine um, before I went to Pilates and, um, I know y'all probably was like, girl, why is it 30 degrees outside and you got on a, um, you got on a crop top, a whole crop top. Because first of all, because first of all, I had on a crop top because I knew I was having some drinks before I was going to Pilates and I was not about to be in there sweating. Like I was already hot. Like, cause I, when I went to my yoga class, I noticed that I had started sweating. I had some drinks before I went to yoga. That's the warm up. That's why I had drinks. Cause you know, you need to warm up before you stretch and all that. So that's how I warm up. <laughs> and um, yeah, I was like, I'm not about to be in here sweating. So I had to uh, um, put on that, on that um, crop top. But yeah, oh, this is burning. But this is about the, uh, this, this is a light pill. This is a real light pill. It's nothing like the TCA pill that I have used. How long are you supposed to leave this on? Directions. They can make these directions a little bigger, like on for no more than 10 minutes. Okay. Sounds like a plan. So, yeah put a little bit more it's burning y'all don't don't let me fool you like i'm just taking it because i want to be cute but it's burned like hell it shit burn like hell shawty <laughs> i miss elena anyways yeah and that's what's been going on so <sighs> Did I show y'all what I got from the crystal store? No. I'm going to show y'all what I got from the crystal store. Let me go get it right quick while this is doing whatever it's doing. While it's doing what it's doing what it's doing. Ooh. All right, y'all, I'm back. I wiped that stuff off my face because, like, it was tingling a little too much. I don't even know if it's been 10 minutes. I don't care. It's been long enough. That's what my spirit told me. So, anyway, I got these assorted um, incense i don't know what these are but i got these from um the store i got those 
and I didn't mix them all up, so I don't know what is what, but incense or incense. And I got this ring, this hematite ring, and this is made out of, you know, crystal. So basically, it collects bad energy, so that way your body doesn't absorb the bad energy. And then um, I got this because y'all know this is what I wanted. This is what I originally went in there for, but I got the frankincense. Frankincense, um, this is mountain sage and frankincense. So I like frankincense, you know. <laughs> That's that rich shit. But anyway, I got that to um, clean the house with. Do y'all know how to use sage? I don't know. I don't know why I'm even asking, but I... I also I got a whole pack of incense. I don't know where it's at. But anyway, I also I got this candle that y'all seen on there. Just this long candle. It's nothing special. It don't even have no smell. I just got it because it said it was Taurus. And because these are like seven day candles, they burn for a very long time. But yeah, y'all, that's all I got. That's all I've been up to for the week. Y'all been with me. Um, I've been doing some other stuff and I wish I could bring y'all with me like when I'm out with my friends and with my family, but we be laughing, telling jokes, everybody talking at once, there's music playing, everybody cussing, drinks going around, it's too much going on. And it's just be hard. Sometimes I be trying to vlog and then I look at the footage and then I throw, like, throw the whole footage away because it was fun when I was there, but it's not really fun to watch. But I'm gonna try to um, do a little bit more with y'all or whatever. Let me just, anyways, y'all. I'm just talking at this point. It's been real. Thanks for hanging with me. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm going to see y'all on the next vlog. Y'all be easy. Peace.